G'day folks, Toby here. Welcome to the channel. Now, uh, today I'm talking about detonators. Um, many, many years ago when I did uh, the very first explosives handling course that I did to uh, get my licence, UBE licence that I use for blasting and doing these videos, uh, they did a demonstration just, just what a detonator will do to your hand. Uh, obviously not using a hand, but using an old work glove such as this one. And uh, a detonator like that. That's a electric detonator. It's actually a, a delay det. You don't see a lot of uh, electric delays anymore. They've slowly been replaced with uh, non-electric dets or signal tube dets. So I've got a few of those. I'm going to blow this one up uh, in the name of science and uh, make a video out of it. We also have one of these old plane detonators. So that's the old uh, fuse deck, crimp the fuse in, light the fuse, that goes off and sets off your explosives. So I'm going to use both of these. I'll show you a close up of those very shortly. I also have a leather work glove and a typical uh, cheap hardware shop gardening glove. So uh, I'm going to go and fire those off. I'll give you a close up of these and then we'll go and uh, stick a bit of sand in these gloves maybe to give them a bit of substance. Stick the detonators in and uh, or on the glove, do a demonstration as to uh, why you should not handle detonators. Okay, so here's a close up of what we're using. Um, there's a you know, delay debt. There's a little number eight on there, so a number eight debt will be, from memory, a three second delay. So I'll uh, yeah, see how the delay goes on that. There's an old, I reckon it was an Indian made plane detonator. The, the bang is in there. And there's one that I just crimped on a minute ago out of the same box. I've got a couple of those left. Um, would not use those on jobs these days. They're uh, very old and a bit, uh, sketchy. They were given to me quite a while ago, so I'm using them up uh, for unimportant bits and pieces around the place. But uh, yeah, we're going to do a very important video with this one. So let's go down to the range where it's nice and safe to fire these off and uh, make a bit of noise. Okay, that did not do as much as I expected it to, but that's why the detonator hasn't gone off properly. I've had quite a few that have done this. Match, which is another reason you would never use, and that wouldn't set off high explosives. See the white in the end there? That's actually um, PETN or similar RDX, possibly. So the initial primary's gone off, but it hasn't actually set off that explosive. So I'm going to blow up a whole lot of these remaining debts at some point because uh, that makes another bit of a danger to dispose of then. So that was not a uh, proper test, it's just been a little pop, that little pop's supposed to set off the main charge, so it's done very little to that. So I reckon we put this glove and the other glove and a modern detonator and uh, fire those. That's up next. Okay, modern detonator, I'll be firing for this stinger system. And we'll see what it does. Sitting in the same spot, we'll put our nice tough leather glove on top. Make sure it's actually on top of it, yep. For a bit of added effect, we'll uh, sit that one on top there too. Let's see what that does. Okay, so that is a pretty good demonstration as to why one should not hold a detonator in the hand. Is um, the glove that's pretty well shredded. Probably keep a few fingers cut. 
out a little velocity thumb there. And I'd say that would have taken off these two fingers here. You see the little scrape marks. Travel. There you go. Didn't come through the other side, but it has uh, shattered this. Amazing. Retrieve this. Didn't it? The delay on it didn't seem to work. It just went bang straight away. So that's where the delay element is supposed to be. Looks like it's just gone bang, that's alright. I can just use these ones as instantaneous deaths anyhow. So I can use these to set off the tube. There's uh, where the detonator was sitting there. Over here, it's glove number two. I reckon you would have kept this hand. Would have stung a bit, but I reckon you'd still have fingers on that one. So there you go, do not hold that notice in your hands and set them off, you will lose fingers. Pretty obvious, but yeah, it's a good demonstration as to why you have to be really, really careful with debts, because um, they tingle. Yeah, that is not what you want to happen to your hand. So if you dig up a detonator when you're metal detecting, um, you will occasionally find them out in the bush, out on old muller keeps. Um, don't muck about with them. You can actually ring WorkSafe and they'll dispose of them for you, or ring the police and I'll get someone to come and dispose of them, but they're uh, very far from toys. So, one detonator, one decent bang, one old dodgy one, so I might have to do a video blowing up the remaining stock of those old ones. I certainly don't want to use them, and uh, they're not something you want sitting around. So thanks for watching, folks. Um, got plenty more mining and hopefully a bit more blasting content coming up soon. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, I'll... See you on uh, YouTube soon.